Hey what's up guys, Hubadoo Gaming is back here with another NBA 2K17 tutorial video and in this video I will be showing you guys how to get updated NBA rosters in your NBA 2K17 working for PS4, Xbox One, PS3 and, and Xbox 360. So it will be a bit different for PS3 and Xbox 360 but you do follow the same exact steps. Just follow what I'm doing. It may not look the same, but it is the same, all right? So you go to options and features right here. I'm gonna jump right into it. And then you go to roster creator, all right? Once you go there, click create roster. In the bottom left, you can see that. And then right here, you look at, you can up download any of these rosters, all right? But the one we're gonna be downloading is the off season. 2k18 offseason draft slash trades all right so they're gonna click on that and let it download now once it's downloaded you can see that these are the updated rosters victor oladipo darren collison on the pacers uh let's see um what other thing avery black bradley on the pistons here uh duh, duh, duh. chris paul on the rockets so you guys can see that these are the updated rosters now click circle to go back and click save roster now you have to name it something so name it anything really i'll name it you 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 all right and click options to save and now um you go to play now and click play now it's loading i'm sorry all right now you click triangle once you get here and click on you 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 and there you go you have the updated rosters uh let me just show you guys there you see that jimmy butler is not on the bulls and zach levine is so the only bad thing about this is i don't think you can play blacktop you can't play online you can't do any of that with these rosters but you can play quick game with this so if you have like a friend over or something, you guys want to play with updated rosters on 2K16, I mean 2K17, just load it up and that's about it. And another thing is, is that you have to download the ros uh If there's like a new trade or anything, you have to download the roster again because um, you just downloaded it. So you don't have to download it again. So you have to repeat the process and name it something else, I guess so that you can get the new rosters all right so i'm sorry about that there's nothing i can do about that because it is 2k but um that's really it for the video hopefully you guys did enjoy this video if you guys did be sure to hit that like button subscribe um share this video with your friends um because i know a lot of them probably will be needing this help and that will be it hubby gaming is signing out peace